a coil with 205 turns of wire so the number of turns is 205 a total resistance so the resistance of the coil is 23 ohms and a cross-sectional area the cross-sectional area is 0 0.25 squared meters is positioned with its plane perpendicular to the field of a powerful electromagnet so let's assume that this is the coil its plane is perpendicular to a field so this is the field and if we draw the normal line to the coil it will be like this so the normal line and the magnetic field are parallel to each other so the angle between them is zero degrees again the magnetic field is perpendicular to the plane of the coil and the normal line is also perpendicular to the normal of the coil so the magnetic field and the normal are parallel now what average current we have to find the current uh, is induced in the coil during 0 0.25 seconds so the time duration delta t is 0 0.25 seconds so that the magnetic field drops from we have two values for the magnetic field an initial value which is 1.6 tesla and a final value which is 0, 0.0 tesla so if we wanted to find the change in the magnetic field delta b equals b final minus b initial then delta b is equal to 0 minus 1.6 delta b is equal to negative 1.6 tesla to solve this question to find the induced current first we have to find the induced electromotive force using the formula uh, okay. E M F induced is equal to minus N the change in magnetic flux over time E M F induced is equal to minus N delta of B A cosine theta over delta T So, E M F induced equals minus N. We take the factors that are not changing out and we keep the variable after the variation factor delta. So, minus N A cosine theta delta B by delta T. We replace E M F induced is equal to minus 205 the area is 0 0.25 cosine of 0 delta B which is negative 1.6 over delta T which is 0 0.25 so E M F induced is equal to Now to find the current we will use R is equal to E M F induced over I induced which means that 23 is equal to 328 over I induced 